Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's the tutorial, uh, let us uh, set up my Comfast EW71, which is designed to be an outdoor router, but it can also be used, of course, as an indoor router. This Comfast E71 uh, has a high power uh, Wi Fi coverage access point, wherein it is an omnidirectional using a Qualcomm chip. Okay, so right now, uh, we're going to extend my signal uh, using this uh, router. So as you can see, I am connected right now using my JAR 2.4 uh, Wi-Fi. It says connected, but if I'm going to uh, go to uh, my fast.com or if I'm going to ping a website, it's not going to give us a good result okay so because the signal is really really poor it has a three to four bars only so sometimes it's not showing in my oh, wi-fi no. so okay so first let's uh, connect our router so from scratch here is our uh, physical connection setup so they are already color-coded and easy to follow all right so I'm going to uh, plug in now the power of my uh, Comfast EW71 and as you can see now and dito na ang ating uh, Comfast uh, underscore 6F2E underscore 2G this is its default Wi-Fi uh, SSID so make sure that your Comfast EW71 uh, is uh, configured in default setting okay so you might need to uh, press and hold the reset button para my reset ang yung compass okay so let's try to connect now okay so by default it doesn't have any password and right now we are now connected so let's access and configure its interface so the default IP address for this one is 192.168.1 and then you can see right here a globe icon so if your language is set to uh, Chinese uh, please click this uh, globe icon and select uh, the English uh, option okay and then by default it will kind of ask you to enter your password so let me just try to put say password 123 capital P Go. and then let's just log out and test if our new password is working and yeah, so it's working right now and as you can see its current uh, configuration is uh, in router state all right it doesn't have any internet right now because it's not configured yet so our goal today is to boost or extend my uh, Wi-Fi signal below up here in my second floor okay so to do that let's click on the wizard and there's uh four options right here so router right now this is in our router mode so we got bridge access point and repeater so as we know access point this will basically uh, extend your uh, uh router using a LAN cable connected to your switch or to your router or to your modem while bridge and repeater will basically they have um, the same uh, purpose not to extend uh, the signal so i'm using uh, the bridge option at this point you can also use the mandor repeater but for me i prefer to use uh, this bridge option right here so let's click it and this is its uh, default ip configuration you may want to change this if you would like to make it the same uh, on your uh, network so that you can access them easily uh, the next time around but at this point let us just make it on default state okay click on next it, it, it has only uh, one uh, uh, band network the 2.4 so if you have 5 gigahertz band uh, you can use uh, or you can buy the uh, Compass EW73, but that is actually more 
uh, expensive than this okay speaking of its prices pala no so uh, the price for this uh, router is ranging from 1200 to 1500 sa Lazada workshop okay so let's click on the scan button no para may scan natin ang ating mga nearest wifi signal so let us look for this one the jar 2.4 this is my signal my wi-fi below and then once selected click on this and then you have to put in its password to continue and then pwede mo rin naman tong bagbukin okay let's say i'm going to put this ssid 2.4 using our Comcast EW71 and then I'm going to put the same password and then next and then finish okay so let's get back to it once the router is ready Alright, so our router has just uh, finished rebooting, so we can now connect to our router. So let's check our signal. We can see here the uh, JAR 2.4 CF EW71, and as you can see, it has an excellent signal. So let's try to connect to it. There we go, and then let me just put in the password. Cancel this and double check if I am connected. Alright, so let's try again. Click OK. And so we are now connected to this uh, Compass EW71. So let's check our uh, network connection. So, before we test if our internet is working, let us try to uh, modify or back uh, log in to its interface again. So there you go. I've already configured my uh, TCP IP so we can access my router here. And let us just try to refresh this page. And there you go. As you can see, uh, this is its current state. It's now in bridge mode. Okay, and this is our wireless uh, SSID right now. And it is currently linked to a JAR 2.4 gigahertz. Okay, so let us now try to test the internet. And to do that, let us remove, of course, you have the uh, IP. IP but automatically updated. Go. And then from here, we can no longer access this page since our IP address from the router is different from the IP address of our uh, Compass. Checking its status, my IP address is now uh, 192.168.1.1 that one, that one. that's okay so let's oh wait let me disable first my uh, LAN connection just to make sure yeah, so that only our wireless network connection is uh, running right now go refresh the fast.com let's check if we are still connected yep and let's then in here okay. google.com we're getting a reply now at this point, but for some reason the fast.com is still not showing up. Let's try again. Are you on? Oh, okay. So earlier from zero or from nothing, now we are getting a speed of at least 7.5 for the first test. And for the second test, we are getting an 
8.9 so this is good already no so this uh, with this uh, speed we can actually uh, uh, watch uh, a YouTube video even in uh, 1080p mode no? so let us see if we can do that now with house TV Let's try to uh, watch this and see if we can watch uh, with a 1080p. Yeah, it's running right now with no problem, and the thing is still uh, in good shape. All right, so uh, mission accomplished. We just successfully set up our Comcast EW71 as a bridge from zero internet to having 8.9 mbps is good already okay so thank you so much for watching guys i hope you like my video don't forget to like and subscribe so uh, once again this is webhouse tv thanks everyone and bye